Hey, this is another Dark Souls Blender plugin uh, progress report of sorts. Um, summer classes are about to start up, and I wanted to do uh, one more video before I sort of uh, go into hibernation, I guess you could say. I did make a couple of uh, improvements since the last video, um, so let's check out a little bit of that. Well, I guess for starters, one thing is um, I now made it so that you could open a couple of other file types, uh, notably these that end in B and D. And these are all, again, extracted from the uh, Unpacked Dark Souls for modding. I know with uh, Dark Souls Remastered out, the um, a lot of the file types are the same. In fact, I think the majority of the stuff is sort of set up the same way. But I don't know what sort of unpacking is necessary. I haven't really looked into that at all. I know some other people have been doing uh, a lot of work on that. So these OBJ uh, folder has this OBJ B and D. These are like in-game objects, instances, like things like crates and barrels and bonfires. Uh, these parts, and these are, this is weapons and armor. Um, and there's also character B and Ds, which is um, in-game characters. So let's start by opening one of these now. Some of these, the textures unpack properly, and some of these do not. As you can see, they come with their uh, potential weapons. I guess these are, I guess he can equip, uh, switch between bow and spear here. I'm not sure exactly. Well, let's see if this has any. So this has a material, but it's not the proper one. So uh, sometimes these load properly, and that's something I've got to work on. The success rate on texture loading is not as good for the uh, BND files as for the uh, map files. Let's see what this one is. Okay, so uh, so places like Undead Berg, I have a higher success rate of, of texture loading. Places like the Painted World of uh, Ariamis, not as not as high. So as you can see, if I click, if I open this one, it has some of the textures of the Great Dragon loaded, but it has others that are not loaded, and some of this is just simple bug stuff I've got to work out in the code. So, oops, well, let me just delete all of it. And then lastly, for good measure, let's look at the parts. And I'll just grab one of these, a female armor set. So this one looks like it is loading properly. So if I do a cycles preview of that, Just pick one. There we go. So that loads in pretty well. Anyway, again, that's not as consistent. That's something I, I do want to get up and working properly, but first priority is the maps right now. So another issue that I've solved is the one where all the faces weren't loading. I do have it now set so that they do all load in, I believe, 100% of the time. So this is part of, I guess, Farling Shrine. Um, another thing that I'm working on is uh, the game uses a lot of these uh, textures that will uh, where it does a fade between two different textures. And I've mentioned this before. Um, I've got something in progress, so I'm going to try to get that to load properly in game at least majority of the time. I'm going to have to kind of use a couple of little tricks to get that to work in Blender. Anyway, hopefully, I mean, probably realistically, it won't be until between the summer and fall semesters when I can really uh, get back into this pretty pretty deeply so hopefully then I can get a version sort of packaged up nicely and I'll put it on a github or something like that if anybody else wants to mess with it but right now my codes in sort of an embarrassing state it just needs a lot of optimization and stuff and I'm, I'm kind of learning as I go so there's a lot of improvements to be made I would like to be in a better state than it is right now and have some of these uh, wish list items taken care of as well um, so anyway uh, that's it for now it may be a while before I check in again. Well, I mean, hopefully I'll have time in the semester to work on it, but if not, I'll definitely have time between summer and fall, and hopefully I can get something to a presentable state by then. So thank you for checking it out, and I'll see you when I see you.